Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Hello everyone. Now, let us start our lesson by our school children. مدرسة المجتمع الابتدائية الإعدادية الثانوية الخاصة للبدن إعداد فتيات متعلمات مبدعات قادرات على بناء مجتمع واعي متحضرا محافظا على أخلاقه وقيمه ومستخدما للتكنولوجيا الحديثة مدرسة Now let's move on to our lesson for today Today we are going to study 103 3C grammar still on page 39 Our objectives for today The first year between sense of four in use after reading the dialogue and the grammar box carefully. 2. Complete the dialogue between two people using present perfect example or past simple correctly. And our vocabulary for today, yesterday, last week, ever, never, already, just, since, and for. Now, let us start. To start our activity, I want you just to watch the video and answer the following question. Keep this question in your mind. What is the video about? What did you learn from this video? Now, start. Grammar. Present perfect versus the simple past. The present perfect uses have or has plus past participle. The past participle here been and gone. Sometimes it's called the third form. The present perfect is used when we don't mention years, days, hours, and other times. I've been to Paris. Here, no time is mentioned. We're simply focusing on an experience sometime in the past. The present perfect is used for non-specific time. I've been to Paris three times. Again, no specific dates were mentioned. Because there's no sequence, we use the present perfect. We use the present perfect when there's no time sequence. I've been to Paris, London, and Cincinnati. Even if there are different locations, we still use the present perfect if there is no time order. The simple past. Here, was, were, and went are in the simple past. It is sometimes called the second form. The simple past is used for specific time. I went to Paris last year. Here we used a specific time, last year. So we used the simple past. We can also say that the simple past is like finished time. It's no longer connected with the present. I went to Paris when I was six. Here, the focus is on the time phrase, when I was six. The event is no longer connected to now, so we use the simple past. The simple past is also used for a time sequence. I went to Paris, then to London, and finally to Cincinnati. Here, the focus is on the sequence of events. First to Paris, then to London, then finally to Cincinnati. Therefore, we use the simple past. Um, what is this? What the hell is my body? Okay, did you get the point? Could you answer the previous question? Now let us check. We are, now we are going. We are in the three C part two grammar for verse sense. So our main focus will be in the using of for and sense. Now open your book. Three grammar. We have your present perfect simple and for and sense. We label the dialogue. When did Harry met Tony? Okay. Think about these examples. Hi, hi, Harry. How long have you known Tony? I've known him for 10 years since I was a teenager. Think about blue words, okay? Move on to the second one. I have here the for plus a period of time. So we use for for a period of time. For example, two years. 
a week, six months, an hour, five minutes, a long time. So we use four plus a period of time. How can I uh, use sense? So I use sense plus a point in a time. Specific point in a time. For example, since Sunday, yesterday, 2 o'clock, 2010, last week, I uh, left school. So, the main difference between 4 and sense, so we use 4 for the period of time, sense, when a point, about a point in time. Now, have a look at this example, just we are going to emphasize that. Have here 4 plus a period of time, number plus time word. When we measure the duration of something or how long it lasts, it has a start, point, and an end point and can be used in different senses. Have a look at the examples here. I studied English in Ireland for two years. So I have to talk about you what? About the duration, not a specific time. So I have you what? A number or the time plus the time word, two years. I will be there for around two months. So I have you four and two months. We have been married for 14 years. So, have you, have you have here the structure again? We have here four, for ten minutes, for eight hours, for five days, for six months, for three years, and for two centuries. Did you get the point here? So again, we use four plus, yeah, or four periods of time, not a specific one. Move on to the, to the second part. We have your what sense. We use sense when we, when we have a starting point or the time and date. When something is starting in the past and continues continues until now, sense is mostly used in the present perfect and perfect progressive tense. He has an evening since 7 o'clock. I have been working here since June. We have been married since 2002. So I have what? A specific time or starting point. Have a look at the examples here. Since 8 o'clock, since Monday, since February, since 1982, since I left school, since the end of the last century. So, did you notice the difference between them? Okay, now let's move on. Move on to your book exercise P. Complete with the present perfect simple or the past simple of the verb in the practice and circle for or since according to the sentence. Pause the video now and answer them. Okay. Now let's see. I not speak to Ali for or since last Saturday. I I have you what not. How can I form negative sentence in the book in the present perfect? Yeah. For the I I use have would not will be haven't spoken. To Ali, since last Saturday, I have what starting point or a specific time? Really, I yesterday have you the keyword what yesterday? Yes. If we work this one a point and guess I have you yesterday. This one indicate I'm talking about and past action. So they have you what? So okay, moving to number two. You Fatima last night have you what the keyword is? Last night, how can I form question? In the past, I used that. Did you call Fatima last night? Actually, but I have been called her f for or since a week. For a week, I'm talking about what? A duration of time, that's right. Who went to number three? How did you answer this one? You make a friend yet. I have you yet. This one indicates what? Present perfect, that's right. Have you made any friends yet? Yes, I have made three friends for or since we since we moved to the neighborhood. So since we moved, that's right. Moving to number five number four, sorry. Mr. Smith has left in this house. For a long time. That's right. I'm, sure I'm talking about what? A duration of time. That's right. He put this house house in 
99. That's right. Mm, okay. Complete with, by using what for ourselves. Here you have what name structure. Or this one going to help you to answer this question correctly. Pause the video now and answer them. Okay. What do you think about the first one? I haven't seen her since yesterday evening. So I'm happy. And we have in this sentence specific time. That's right. Salim hasn't been to to the gym a week. Did I mention the time here or not? Yeah. Now talk about the duration of time I use. Four. Fatima hasn't spoken to Sahar. She moved last year. Since. That's right. They have left in the UK six months. That's right. For six months. Gray hasn't seen her has uncle ten years since or for fourteen years. That's right. I have no no Wendy, she was five years old since she was five years old. It has been a long time. Jamil called me since that's right. I have only known Amy a couple of weeks, but I really like her so for a couple of weeks. That's right. Okay, now let's continue. Now look at the pronoun and why sentence. Use principal six of four since we got simple, okay? Move on to your book now. Page 39, okay? Yeah, pause the video now and try to answer this one. Have you, for example, played play two different tedious games since you get, get home? How can I form a sentence here? Pause the video and answer. Okay, now let us see. Brain has played two different video games since he got home. That's right. I now see Julia since she come over last weekend. How can I form a sentence there? Yeah, we will keep this one. I will take the second one here. Yeah, Mickey not have trouble seeing since he got new pet. Mike has not had trouble sleeping since, notice here where I put since he got a new pet. Over to number, number three. Yeah, take this one. And Jima has been to Paris three times since she moved to Europe. Did you answer this one correctly? Yeah. Now let's move on to the second picture here. I haven't seen Julie since she came over last weekend. Dad not changed her style since he be university. Dad hasn't changed his her style since he was at university. So I use he what? Present perfect. Then I use what? Since then? He passed. That's right. We have yes here. Present perfect. Then what? Since. That's right. He got home. Did you answer this one correctly? Very good. Now let's go on to our closure. Yeah, just practice using since and for. Have a look at this one. You should wash the card you have been washed at ages. Think about this one. What is the suitable one? It's for or since? For ages or since ages? What do you think about this one? Yeah, keep the answer for you. Yeah, just to practice the using sense of for. I'd better have a shower I have been have one Thursday. What do you think? Since for Thursday? Does it make sense? Yeah, answer this one in your notebook. Okay, just practice. Move on to the third one. I have then spoken to Ali. March. Through March? Mm hmm. Or since March? That's right. Think about this one. Yeah, here. Hamad has been on holiday two weeks. For two weeks or since for two weeks. I'm talking about what? Duration or specific time? 
again think about this one now they have had cold, a cold friday since friday or for friday yeah yeah i'm talking about what specific time which is friday what is a suitable one for or since okay yeah answer this one i i want to see your answer in the class okay if you have any question just you can label this one and we are going to discuss this one in the school okay that was everything for our lesson today hope you could benefit if you have any question just feel free to ask me and see you next time inshallah